Hey guys, and welcome to Life is Strange, episode 5. This is the final part, and with this, we're going to see what is the final result of everything going on. We will see what everything has led to as a final result. So, so far we know that Mr. Jefferson is the guy behind everything. We know that everything crazy has happened because of Mr. Jefferson and Nathan. So, let's just get straight into this and see where all this leads. And if you ever Previously see on Life is Strange. Skull candy headphones to try and do this a bit properly. What did you Good find? Possible, so Rachel in the dark room. Over and over. That's it. We can't trust anybody. Let's make sure that um, each other. the... You know more about her than me. No, no you and Chloe you think you know more than anybody. So, like all teenagers. Audio and, uh, wouldn't work out. Oh, look. The Wonder Twins. What are you doing in my dorm? Head you are you so fucking dead! Nathan is truly a psychotic. I know he has something to do with Rachel missing. Drop a little. It wasn't the first. All those binders are filled with other victims. What are you doing here, Max? Victoria has to be next. What a lame gimmick. Rachel, why is he putting her on the ground like this? Where? The junker. Max, we have to find that spot now. Ugh. Now's the end of the episode four. How? What the fuck? <sighs> it was still down like that part. And Jefferson is a dick. Right. Life is strange. It's a story-based game. The future's play is short. The consequences of your actions in the game. Actions and decisions will impact the past, present, and future. Choose wisely. Checkpoint. I'm looking forward to this game. I've had it there for months, so I've been seeing it for a while. I've been looking forward to this game since I moved part 4. And if you've never played this game, if you've never even been to the time before, watch my previous playthroughs or play this game yourself. It is a brilliant game. Square of the Nyx. A lot of lenses. Camera equipment. God damn you, Mr. Jefferson. Strange polarized. My internet has been on the blink a little bit, so at the moment I'm playing this on Steam on the in the offline mode. So um, when this episode is completed, I won't be able to look at the um, results of other people, like like percentages and that sort of thing. That's the only thing that I'm kind of sucking about at the moment. So when this goes up and everything, my internet will be better, so hopefully that should happen tomorrow. And I will tap down to a chair. Um, not good. Oh, he's got, he's got Victoria. What? I'm with Victoria then. Okay. It's a dark room. So and so you assume that it's just it's been either Mr. Jefferson grabbed it or Nathan grabbed it. Sorry. Is anybody out there? 
email with a bunch of these. It's not gonna work. Oh shit! Jefferson kidnapped Victoria too. This is so bad. Victoria, wake up! Wake up! I'm free. Almost. Trolley. Okay, so I'm gonna move the trolley. Are we doing this? No. God. I don't remember anything that Hold happened. Hold the trolley. This must be the same drug Nathan used on Kate. I hate looking at myself like that. You paid for this, Jefferson. Focus on the trolley. Okay. I promised I would never go back in time like this again. But this is the only way. Um, picture of me, I look quite out of it. Oh, that'd be great. Quick, while it's going on. Max. Clean my eyes. This angle highlights from pure AC. The slightly unconscious one was often the most open and honest. Posing in just pure expression. Oh, Christ, look at that perfect face. Damn, that's creepy. Hold that stare then! Stay still! No, I'm gonna go. Okay, yes, maybe no, okay, I guess I'm not. Max! You fucked up my shot! Glad to be of service. But please don't worry. We have all the time in the world. For now, I knew you were special the second I saw your first You should probably selfie. turn around. There seems to be a big black yes. orby blob like Still right behind you. Yes, I know it's to be with the plumbing. But I love photography of the aerial picture of the present thing. He's always looking in the wrong places. Poor Rachel. Let me try this angle. Oh yeah, get on top of me. Yes, now I can kick you in the nuts. Don't move! But I want to. Moving is my best part. <sighs> Much better. Thanks, Max. If only Nathan could see this setup. He tried so hard. But you can't just throw a few subjects around and expect a cohesive style or theme. But he had an eye for shadows. Yeah, but he loves a right dollar And fight. an eye for a whole lot more. As his elite family will find out. Along with Arcadia. Well, his family are a little bit douches anyway. Nice. Oh, God. I'm gonna roll my head this way. Oh, those eyes. Leave my eyes alone. Just because I'm doped up and I can't do anything. too bad you're so goddamn nosy, Max. But this room. Is under 24 7 surveillance, so all I had to do was text you from Nathan's phone. And you fell right in. Why didn't the Nathan have his phone? You really should have focused on schoolwork, not private detecting with your little friend. Chloe. Chloe, right. Yeah, I'm sorry that I killed. that Nathan killed her in self defense. But she Dick. had a troubled history, like most Arcadia Bay dropouts. Nobody will be surprised. Or care. Though I promise, people will care when you die tonight, Max. I wasn't lying when I said you have a gift. Okay. Now this looks good. Maybe a few more close-ups. Clicky camera out of my face. Max, please do not but I move want so to much. Move. I need you posed and framed my oh, way. My way, not yours. So leave me alone. A new dose will calm you oh, down. No. No. I'm good the way I am, thank you. 
Please don't. Now don't move or this will hurt much. I'm gonna kick you. <laughs> Shit, I missed. Stupid I broke your bitch. I broke your drugs. You just don't listen, do you? I try not to, especially not to you. You never did hear much in my class. Because oh, it's not very you interesting. Might, you might have seen all this coming. God damn you are a fighter. Yeah, if I could swing my if right I hand my on you, or my left or both you in the face, I would have made your whole life. I'm too dirty. Remember my number one rule. Always take the shot. Well, Chloe was the one with the gun. You cheated. You shot her instead. Dick. Yes. His files are ruined. Whoa. Oh, Jesus. I can't believe that happened. So sick. Yes. Let's see if anything else is anything else. Oh, she's awake. Oh, she's waking up. Sorry. Okay. Okay, let's talk to you. Victoria. Hey, Victoria. Bitch, you lady. It's Max. Wake up. It's me. Can you hear me? Max. Oh, God. Where... Where are we? Man, no, oh, I was like, what's happening? You've been drugged like Kate. And me. Do you remember how you got here? No. I don't know. Please. You warned me. You warned me about Nathan. Then I went to Jefferson for help, and he oh, was Oh, God, that's how you got caught. You went to Jeffy. That's the last thing I remember. And I can't move my hands. Help me, Max. Please. I'm kind of strapped so down to a chair, so I can't help. Listen carefully. Mark Jefferson kidnapped us. He's using Nathan as well. Jefferson is very dangerous, so we have to get out of here before he comes back. Max. I just can't believe this is real. I don't want to die like this. I'm only 18. So is Max. You're not the only 18 year old here, you know. Shut up. You're being too loud. Shh, shh, shh. Victoria, we don't want to bring Jefferson back. Please, let me think. <coughs> Are you kidding? We're fucking trapped. I know, I know. But we have to stay focused. So I can use my quick time trapping powers. Get us out of here. I just, I need you to be strong. I can't do this alone. You keep distracting me. We need to act while we're clear-headed. If he doses us again, we'll forget everything. Then Kate Marsh is telling the truth. Even though I knew she wasn't lying. And I could have helped her, Max. You caused But what? I hurt her. You caused her now to commit suicide. It's my turn. We're both here. We're both here. Okay? I just can't believe this is happening. Matt Jefferson will do this to me. To us. Victoria, we will find a way to escape. I promise. Max, I believe you. I'd really like to smash that fancy camera into Jefferson's face. Oh, I'm definitely more awake in this photo. I could try this one. Wait, Jefferson couldn't handle stains on his photos. Good. Now I can Get use that. Get us out of here. I will. Just try to be calm. This might work. Please work. I'm getting some spectacular images here, Max. Yes, Victoria would kill to be in your place, but she doesn't understand our connection. I don't care. We don't have You're a You're the winner, Max. I I'm not a Pokemon. You, your portrait. Fuck you. You're trying too hard. No, I'm not. I'm trying I know you're scared. You will 
had the same doe-eyed look no, when you wake up here. Replaced by fear as you realize what's about to happen. Mr. Jefferson, why are you doing this? Oh, Max. I'm so glad you asked that question. Uh, simply put, I'm obsessed with the idea of capturing that moment. Innocence evolves into corruption. That shift from black to white to gray. So basically, you want most black models are sick. Of they getting someone like Max that and night turning them into douches who like to kill some people. Blackwell students carry their hope and uh -huh. optimism with them, like an aura, and those lucky few become my models, my subjects. Yes, you're a psychopath. I'm glad we agree. And this is your last session. Superman, I'll come to your rescue. I'm so sane that nobody knows what's happening to you right now. He's got As point. you can see, Sleeping Beauty here is too harsh for my gentle lens. Not that bad. And don't get me started say, leave on my partner. I had enough of those pro punk sluts in my Seattle. Leave my girlfriend alone. You killed her. You killed Chloe. You murdered you my murdered girlfriend. my best friend. She had a loaded weapon. This was clearly self-defense, but that's what happens when you play with guns. Or try to fuck with me. You're not bad ass. It's better when they don't oh, know. Okay. Like pure, sweet Kate. La la la. Artists don't drive teenagers to suicide for any bullshit views. You trained Nathan to drug Kate, to take photos of her. That's why she's dead. Which makes me sad, Max. I will miss her. Kate had such a strong spirit, it was very satisfying to break it down. You will not get away with this. I want you to know that. Too bad you already made a convincing argument against Nathan in the principal's office. Thank you so much for setting him up for me. I do know that the Prescotts are going to have a major scandal when the town finds out what their elite son has been doing for homework. He's as sick as you. He's as sick as you. Don't judge people, Max. But that's why Nathan never should have been at Blackwell. You don't care. You didn't care about him. You're wrong again. He was genuinely talented, and his father is a serious asshole, as you might know. I know. I became a sort of father figure for Nathan. It happens often, teacher-student relationships. It was kind of touching for a while. Did you tell him everything about your plans at Blackwell? Don't be stupid, Max. I told him what he needed to hear. In return, I had access to the Prescott fortune. Who do you think paid for this glorious dark room and equipment? How else could I get all these hip new drugs for my subjects? Rachel Amber was your victim, not your subject. Oh. Rachel Amber. <laughs> That's the real tragedy. Nathan thought he could be an artist like me. Instead, the dumbass gave her an overdose. Chloe and Rachel. You killed both of them. They're fucking together in heaven right now. Is that what you want to hear? Why? 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 Start listening to me, you dumb cunt. I'm sorry, Max. <laughs> that was not cool. Anyway, Rachel is dead. But no tears. Los Angeles would have killed her anyway, so look at this as a favor. You're evil. Oh, I see. You're good because you stopped your friend from beating Nathan up. I cared more about Nathan than you did. No, you didn't. It's just too bad that he fell in lust with Rachel. He actually thought he could mimic what I do with the camera and subject, like father, but not like son. Where is Nathan now? Dead and buried. <laughs> After what he did to Rachel, I knew I couldn't keep him as a protege for much longer. Now the police will never find his body. Okay. Do you finally get it now, Max? I can't compromise my vision with amateurs. You are an amateur. Look at the trail of death you left behind. You can't blame all this on Nathan. I don't care what you do to me. You're gonna die, motherfucker. 
We're gonna Chloe, die, motherfucker. Rachel, and everybody else. I do love your spirit, man. <coughs> you brought yourself here by your own choice. Anyway, I like my models to be seen and not heard. So I have to make sure there's nothing left behind of you. You're gonna chop okay. chop that into little pieces or now, something. Let's see how these shots came out. I can see why your instant camera is so appealing. You don't need a computer to print your work out. Okay. Nice music. Good journey. I have all those photos in my diary. This could be a way out. Oh, now this one. Okay. Wait, please, Mr. Jefferson. Max, I would love to talk shop, but I really need to go over these pictures, especially while they're fresh in my mind. I think our session was a career high for me. Madam. You, you still have my diary. Don't worry. Nobody's going to read it. Thanks for reminding me. There's nothing more innocent than a teenager's diary. Oh, look at your selfies. What a waste of talent. Look at that shot, Max. I think you I will. Do thank so you. much better. Oh, yeah, I think I will give it a nice, hard, focused, concentrated look. Thank you. chance to fix everything for good come on focus on come on come on it's a dirty to unlock stuff she's annoying we got one post and now get the other one post I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. That was the biggest hack in that to mark that. Right back where I started this insane week. Uh, in episode one. And so nobody was going to hurt Chloe ever again. The corner portrait has been popular since mm -hmm. the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? Who cares? I'm, I'm not into capturing your interest. That's kind of sick, isn't it? <sighs> I guess somebody hasn't had their coffee. Do you want to try again? Okay, okay, the Daguerrean process. Blah, blah, blah. Let's, uh, let's move on. Hmm? Uh, anyway, so the Daguerrean process made portraiture quite popular, mainly because it gave the subjects clear, defined features. You can learn more when you finish reading the assigned chapters. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo when the everyday time heroes come to change to time. The winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the artist. First, let's make it real easy to capture Mark Jefferson. Melissa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. 
bastard. I have to warn David about Jefferson and the dark room. All I need is David's number, and Jefferson is one text closer to life without parole. I should be able to track down David's number from the school pam found you. Five four five six three zero eight two four three. For once, David, I'm praying you'll overreact to this as much as everything else and take Jefferson down fast. Is he going to like a sort of second day of stopping? Oh, that's paid off. You wanted me to enter the contest, asshole. So maybe I'll be going to San Francisco and Jefferson. You'll be going to prison. The past within the past. Am I pushing myself too hard? I'm happy to fix it so you'll be here to get your fancy camera, Victoria. It doesn't... Victoria. It's nice Victoria's to know how you feel. My dad might have time to bust out my... Oh, I see. My dad gave up the world that word is broke for the image because I suck through what Mark Jefferson knows I'm doing for the last time. Oh, Rachel. I'm sorry. Covid. Hi, Kate. Oh. Hey, Max. <coughs> Kate. Sorry if I'm coughing. Listen to me. I am. Always remember that you're reason. not alone. I've got your back no matter what happens. So do a lot of other people. We all care. We're all here for you. You need to know that. Max, that makes me feel so blessed for the first time this week. I, I don't know what to say. That's okay. Neither do I. Maybe we could both use a hug. Thanks. You always know the right thing to do. Victoria, I'm sorry you have to stand next to that psycho. Mr. Jefferson, we need to talk. Uh, Can you see I'm talking to Mr. Jefferson now? Yes, I see. But maybe you shouldn't. Uh, and why not? Hold on, Victoria. Are you okay, Max? I will be when Victoria understands that hiding behind a screen, posting videos of people is incredibly cruel and unfair. Tell her, Max. You're smart enough to know how easy it is to hurt somebody, to destroy their life. I just want you to think about how much it would hurt if somebody did that to you. You can always make the right choice, Victoria. I know you've got a yeah, heart. I've seen it. I've seen it. Listen, I... I didn't... You don't have to explain. There's no reason for you to be so insecure that you can't be happy with your own talent. True. Wouldn't it be better to yeah, lift true. people up than to bring them down? You could inspire people. Okay, I don't know what you're talking about now. Do I, Mr. Jefferson? I think I should stay out of this one, Victoria. Go. Then I guess I'm done talking. That's okay, too. Nice one, Max. We we'll use that swagger. That was kind of random, Max. What did you mean? Here's my photograph for the Everyday Heroes contest. Oh, uh, that was easy. No, it wasn't easy at all. Well, I, uh, I, I can't prejudge yet, but I'm very happy you decided to enter. That means a lot to me. And Blackwell. The first step for any artist is to put themselves out there in the world without fear. To be innocent. Or guilty. Uh, well, thanks for the photo. And maybe both of us will be jet-setting to San Francisco this Friday. Or maybe only one of us will be going. Don't be so modest, Max. Anything can happen in a week. As you're going to find out, Mr. Jefferson.
that's not changed. Okay. Neither is that. We found the bunker. Nathan and Mark and Paul Mustard. Nathan isn't dead. And her body. I won. Okay. Hey, Kate's there as well. Okay. So Kate is alive. And Chloe's mind going down. There. Isn't it? Well, I'm getting on the taxi. Ta uh, taxi, taxi. Okay. Whoa! Come on, come okay. On. You're okay, Max. Um, You're safe. Go on. Go on a plane. Okay. Oh, I hope I did everything yeah. right this time. Oh. Good work, David. Holy shit, you rule, man, because I am so proud of you. Chloe. Oh, my no. superstar, this is just what you oh, need to start your career. I did it. I fixed everything. That was a bit too easy. Wow, sir. Well, as we don't haven't got to the bottom of the apparent tornado. Newspaper. The beginning of the end for Jefferson and the Prescotts. Acting on a black prosecutor in covers black bunker and scandal. Acting also as a tip from David Madison has secured a black pedaling police officers to send it Tuesday on a bizarre integration that must be used by a teacher, Mark Gibson, and student Nathan Prescott to do drug, kidnap, and photograph a woman. Although there were no other signs of physical assault being sought on the victims, the disturbing revelation has sent by shockwaves through the tranquil city of Arcadia Bay. Even Sean Prescott, the most powerful business man in the area, is under scrutiny. Okay. Aw, I haven't seen Hot Dog Man in forever. Chloe and I used to totally play the video game and watch him all the time. <laughs> when we were innocent. What the hell am I supposed to think It's so about? weird to be in between realities. So actually, Everything is real out of focus just and in the football. distance. Okay. To admit, I love being called an artist. Excuse me, sir. Your phone has been shut off before you can leave. I'm in San Francisco. I'm so stressed, but I'm so excited to. Passenger seat and stow any electronic gear until the plane is on the ground and at the gate. Thank you. We're starting our descent. In a few minutes. It's a beautiful day in San Francisco with clear skies and cool 60 degrees. We hope you enjoyed your trip and we thank you very much for choosing Pacific West Air. Come fly with us anytime. Uh, I don't think so. I'm hoping these airline seats get smaller so I won't have to fly at all anymore. How did you sleep? Hope I wasn't snoring out loud, Max. Yes. You were Jessica. awful. I couldn't get a winker shut out of you. Wouldn't it's shut up. been a tough week at Blackwell. So I hope you'll forgive me. No, Between I won't. Mr. No. Jefferson no, I don't want to. Prescott's. Things have been. You didn't believe me. To say the I least. Me totally waving that gun around. Wells. That's a smart way of telling me to stop one. <laughs> we are proud of you for representing Blackwell at the Everyday Heroes Contest. I know I'm not exactly the guy you wanted in San Francisco. 
The gallery now. Okay. The Zeitgeist Gallery. Bionic Man. Mother and Baby. This man and his son. All sorts of weird stuff. So is the buffet. If an event skimps on the food, you know it's a bad event. <laughs> as long as I don't have to eat any caviar. This is your day, Max. You can do whatever you want. I hope you take advantage of your status and talk to as many influential people here as possible. I Work think I will. I don't know. I, I feel so weird, like I'm a little kid hanging with the adults. Max, after this week, you are certainly not a little kid anymore. In fact, you're a noteworthy adult being honored by your peers. Now you have to start acting like the photographer you want to be. I think I will. Hell, Thank you. I wanted to be in charge of the big school someday. You would, yeah. So I started taking charge of things when I was young. Ah, sure. I'm still. My poor classmates. Max, I'm going to eat up that caviar so you don't have to. Thank you. Uh, better get in there and start schmoozing. I'm you know, stop I won't always be here to take charge. You. But you come talk to me whenever I you want. Well, well. Come on, Max. After everything that's happened, this should be the least scary thing you've ever done. Wow, sir, Max. You did it. Somehow. I never thought I'd get to speak to a gallery receptionist about my own work. Nice. Well, good morning. You must be Max Caulfield. Congratulations for your everyday heroes photo. The exhibition is quite impressive, especially with your entry. Mm -hmm. Empire seems like mine's quite popular. There yes, I am, along with all the other winners. I should say artists instead. I heard Mark Jefferson was supposed to be here tonight. Not anymore. That was so shocking. I have one of his monographs, too. Hold on to it. Uh -huh. His work is Are some you Max serious cash. Bravo on your entry. I'm the art critic for Iris N Magazine, and we would love to include you in a piece about future trendsetters in photography. I'll send you the details this week, if that's okay. Congratulations for your piece. Not my style, but the neon is a nice representation. Oh, shit. Pretentious alert. I don't know what it's going to be representing. Life and its modern entirety. I guess I have to get used to the idea of fancy food I don't want to eat. Okay, yeah, uh, uh, women uh, while digging into the caviar and everything else as well. I know it's kind of simple, but I find this haunting. Right? The instant print makes it look timeless. Nostalgic melancholy. A cool. teen That's cool. Seems pretty mature. It does look a lot like Max. It's, it's, it's not Max. Mark, I do not understand art. That's probably because... How much would you pay for that? Not Lesbian, yeah, best piece well, of the... I have to say, this is the best everyday hero show I've seen since it began. All the pictures say a lot about our times. Bravo. 
Um, excuse me, I, I just wanted to tell you how much I loved your photograph. I've seen a lot today, but there's something powerful and understated in yours. I can't wait to see much more of your work in the future. Journalists. Both be journalists. Hi, excuse me, you're Max Caulfield, right? Um, yeah. Yes. Sorry to bother you, but my name is Danny Lee, and I'm with the Berkeley People's Herald. I edit their art section, and I totally dig your work. Now, I know the whole ironic selfie thing is kind of played out, but there's something timeless about your images. So I I'd love to set up an appointment or, or interview with you when you get a chance. Uh, here's my card. So great talking with you, Max. You too, Danny. Hi, and there she is to save the day. Hi. You did it, Max. You're a real artist. At least, for today. Oh, oh tornado, but if you should have forgotten all about it, just me tell you that you don't forget to put it in the tornado. Okay, we lost uh, you there for a second. Your I'm okay. Uh, jet lag, high altitude. I'm okay. Jet lag, high altitude. Um, things that go bump in the night. Um, trains. Yes, oh, that might be one of the things. Yes. Oh, come on, please answer. What? Oh. Chloe, where are you? I'm so fucking scared. I'm, I'm by the beach. I'm Chloe, can you hear me? Hello? Hello? Oh my god. The tornado was real. Oh, I didn't fix shit. Chloe will die. Arcadia Bay is going to be destroyed. There has to be a way to stop this. For good. Hey. Look at this place. Okay, go away. I guess everybody is a photographer. Oop, didn't mean to do that. Excuse me, I want to ask you a few questions about your work. Sorry, but... It's not this again. Oh, you're my Go Caulfield, away. right? Tell me what kind of instant camera you um, use. Can we talk later? Thanks. I literally do not have the time to deal with everybody. I just have to make one simple change, so I won't end up in San Francisco. Simple. Sorry, San Francisco. Chloe comes first. If you destroyed that, then you wouldn't have won, and the fact you wouldn't have won would mean that you would never have um, gone back in time in the first place to stop. Yeah, my head hurts so I think it's that, but I think basically, yeah, um, like, Jefferson has not gone to prison. Yeah, I didn't think he had. You're burning, burning my girl. 
That bars me. And it's in a raincoat. Great. Oh, fuck. God, no. I'm back here again? I thought I fixed everything. What did you say, Max? What? Jefferson should be in jail, not here. Jesus. It's like you're back in my class. You're still spacing out. Those are not interesting. It might be you're cool if you dick. took one of your patented selfies now. Transformation between the old Max and the new Max. Anyway, kick him in the box. Answer my question, please. Eat shit and die. Eat shit and die. Good answer. Good answer. Hey, your nose is bleeding. Probably gave you too big a dose. Sorry about that, Max. But considering you're about to die. A nosebleed is a first world problem. No, it's a me problem. Oh. I had to let Victoria Chase go. You let her. Don't be stupid. Fucking okay? Her. Oh, damn She's it. exactly where she deserves to be. No. Oh. As if you care. That dilation like a shudder. The pictures you're taking of me now. Too bad you pissed away your gift. You could have won the contest, but you destroyed your own beautiful photograph. What a waste. Well, I don't care. Sorry. I just want to destroy I burned all your stuff. I got a little carried away. Fuck. He burned my diary. Always. That's why I'm still here. Especially since you've developed from nerd to hero within a week. Something weird going on with you. Whoa. Did you see how crazy it is outside? What is that? Oh no, this is what I've been here. You dragged me in here, drugged me, and I couldn't see a thing. It's an honor working with you on these final sessions. I hope these images will be appreciated for what they truly capture. The loss of youth. I ain't gonna wrinkle up for you. <laughs> At least, that's the last lecture you'll ever have to hear from me. And I promise you, no more nosebleeds. Mr. Jefferson, please, don't do this. You don't know what's happening. Shh, 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 shh. Quiet. Quiet, Max. Please. Don't do this. I promise this final dose won't hurt. Okay. I promise this final dose won't hurt. Don't want to be injected. Go away. I promise. This final dose won't hurt. Right, okay. This final dose won't hurt. What? David, watch out! 
Time to shut the fuck up, okay? Go inside. <laughs> David Madsen. He's out cold. Good. I always hated that fascist fuck. Everybody in Blackwell did, right, Max? What? David, watch out! Time to shut the fuck up, okay? What do I do? Time to shut the fuck Don't up! Do that. Bad timing, Max. Too early. Hmm. Don't let me rewind time. Why don't you let me rewind time? Do the whole thing. Bad timing, Max. Too early. Okay. Can't rewind time. Bad timing, Max. Too early. Let's sort sort this out. Oh fuck! God no! I'm back here again. I thought I fixed everything. Right. Damn it. Yeah, all this again. No, David, no. Jesus. David Madsen. He's out cold. Good. I always hated that fascist fuck. Everybody in Blackwell did, right, Max? Okay. <laughs> This oh, what do I do? What do I do? David, watch out! Time to shut the fuck up, okay? David, watch out! How? How did you know that? Okay. That's no different. <laughs> Jesus. David Madsen. He's out cold. Good. I always hated that fascist fuck. Everybody. Go. David, watch out! How? How did you know that? <laughs> Jesus. David Madsen. He's out cold. Good. I always hated that fascist fuck. Everybody in Blackwell did, right? I can see what shame that was. I miss you. No more nosebleed. Wait, hold on. Can I... Can I please ask you for one last... request? Oh. You got me, man. How can I deny that face? Could he please at least play some music so I can drift away? Even at the end, you're still a dreamer, Max. It's a nice trait.
That's not right. No way, Jefferson. Hold it! Nice. Right there, we're getting frozen again. I had it paused, I did that. Uh, one last bit, here's some water. Some water. Uh, excuse me, but my, my throat is scratchy. Can I please have some water? Of course. I don't want you to be uncomfortable. This final dose won't hurt. Please don't. What? David, watch out! Time to shut the fuck up, okay? Not done. David, watch out! How? How did you know that? What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? I don't know what to do. What to do? What to do? What to do? do, you do? Okay, take one, one last picture. Would you uh, take one last picture of me? I, I want to be your best subject. I almost don't believe that, but I think you finally learned from me. Let's put it down there for a reason. Right, okay. So if David comes in and he gets whacked before, I think he might be able to use it as a weapon. Right, okay. Now we're getting somewhere. I promise. This final dose won't hurt. Yes, yes, yes. He told me about that for like 15 times already. What? David, watch out! How? How did you know that? No gun, no balls. Jefferson, it's over. You are not going to stop me. <laughs> David Matson. Of course. Well, this is what you get for playing cop. <laughs> it's over. Grab your gun now. Got it. Nothing, nothing. I don't need my shoulder. David Madsen. It's over. Okay. It's over. Okay. It's over. You are not yeah, going this? to stop me. Oh, we are clocking in the face. Nice one. Oh, Lord, Max. Are you okay? Are you alright? Can you move? Yes. Thank you, David. Thank you. Don't thank me. You brought me here. 
Let's wrap up this son of a bitch first. And he won't be going anywhere when he wakes up. Except you are going to prison forever. Nice one. Or worse. Mr. Jefferson, now it's your turn to be captured in a moment. Save Chloe. He burned everything, including all of my photos. Mm. Warren, yes. Outside the party. I can use that picture he took of us. Shit, no signal. Here's his car. Thanks, Mr. Jefferson, but you won't need this anymore. Good God. It's a st David? Are you okay? Look at this place. It feels like it hell. is hell. Jefferson was was gonna kill me. Like he did to <laughs> Victoria Chase. Oh no. I always suspected that son of a bitch. He suspects of everybody. I never did you suspected everybody. You suspected everybody. You kind of suspected everybody. Yes, and this is what I get for wasting all those hours on the Prescotts. I set my sights too wide. Lack of focus. I know the feeling. I wasn't surprised when you accused Nathan of drugging Kate Marsh. I thought so too. Hey Max, I'll never forgive myself for what happened to Kate. I feel like I helped push her off that roof. Not your fault Kate was bullied. Kate was bullied up to that roof. But it was still Nathan and Jefferson who put her there. I knew Nathan Prescott was a threat. I just waited too long to neutralize him. Jefferson already did. They had some weird father-son thing going on. But Nathan killed Rachel and Jefferson had to use him He's as out a scapegoat. That pervert was pulling all this shit right into my nose, too. I could have stopped him and Nathan if only... I wasn't so stupid. No. I told Principal Wells Nathan had a gun and I almost used it. But he didn't want to believe me. I should have been more... Well, you know, not more like you should have been to regret. Drama. But I have <laughs> to admit, I'm impressed by you. And Chloe. And your investigation. I had all the high-tech toys while well, you had each other. She learned from you. Maybe she learned from you. I think she only learned how to hate my guts. You both had a tough start. And I know it wasn't easy. I'm not going to make any excuses for my behavior. I tried to be a good soldier, but I wasn't so great. I tried to be a good father, too, but when Joyce kicked me out, I had nothing. I was pissed off. I was pissed off and wanted to rage. Yeah, I know the feeling. Too much. I'm going to tell Joyce I was wrong about you. She does love you. It's pretty obvious. I try not to use my service as an excuse, but... It's hard to come home after war. Most people don't know or care what it's like. Except Joyce. She gave me hope. A new life. And you saved mine. Chloe, is she? She would be proud of you. I just want to see her safe with her mother. I promised Joyce I would go see a family counselor. And I'll start by apologizing to Chloe. I don't expect her to call me dad, but maybe she'll stop calling me step douche. So, where is Chloe? Oh, David. I've got to tell him the truth. David. Oh, David. Uh, Chloe is. is dead. This isn't happening. We can't. No, God. Not Chloe. 
Max, are you are you sure? Are you Yes, I I saw her. I I saw a Jefferson killer in the junkyard. Last night. Last night? When I was feeling sorry for myself in my hotel room. No. I, I promised Joyce that I would protect her and Chloe. How can I face her and explain this? I never even told Chloe that I, I God damn it. You killed my wife's child, you sick fucker. And you took away my stepdaughter? David, wait! Uh, that's for Chris. Uh, I thought I'd feel better for a little bit more. I lost some gun. I'm sorry. I'm sorry you had to see that. What a mess. What have I done? All that time I wasted with surveillance. Uh, Chloe, I'm sorry. Joyce, I failed you. My family. You didn't fail. You did your best. Max, you better get outside. You've seen enough of this room. David, thank you for saving me. Oh, David. I'm, I'm, I'm not going to change that. I'm going to leave, keep that choice. All this expensive gear just for sick bullshit. <sighs> that one scene really changes your opinion. Of David, it really does. Freedom. Holy shit. <laughs> this storm is real. I need to. The cake was a lie. Yes. Warren. No. Can you hear the me? wind's too strong. Never mind. Listen, do you have that photo you took last night <clears throat> in the parking lot? Shot. Yes, it, it is, and I, I want it. Where are you? I'm at the Two Wells Diner. Pretty much trapped in here with Joyce thanks to this Armageddon weather. I'm expecting the ocean to turn red. I'm on my way. Come on, that's crazy. You can barely walk on the sidewalk outside. But seriously, Max, stay wherever you are. I don't think the storm's No, it's getting bigger. And bigger. And bigger. That's okay. Bigger. Me too. But it's not over yet, Warren. So hold on. Wow, bloody religious. <laughs> no, because you're swearing on bloody radio. Oh, don't cry, don't cry. Nathan. 